Hey everyone, but I'm here again, and today we are opening some Pokemon cards, but not any kind of Pokemon cards. No, we are opening the Pokemon Detective Pikachu case stuff. So, um, basically we have six different products for this, um, mini-series, I guess. Uh, we have, uh, two to open today. We have the Detective Pikachu case file and the Detective Pikachu special case file, which will come just after. So, uh, yeah, we'll be opening those two today, but we already have the four other different products in the vault. Uh, basically, we will be opening some of these every week until, um, until May, because the movie comes out in May, I believe. Um, the movie comes out on May 3rd in Japan, I believe, and on May 10th in America. So, uh, yeah, we'll do the first installment now, and we'll be opening stuff all the way until the movie. And... To celebrate this, we'll have a giveaway. Yes, we will. Uh, we'll be giving away one of the two uh, Detective Pikachu promo cards because they are the exact same in these two different items. And we'll also be giving away some other Pokemon cards. Uh, the details will follow eventually in the video or in one of the future installments of this mini series. But whatever, without further ado, let's start opening. So this small uh, case file, the normal case file, Opens up pretty nicely. I like the style it has. Um, trying to open it without going hard will be difficult because this is between two slabs of cardboard. I don't know if you guys can see there's like a separation in the middle here. But you just have to basically break everything. So we have our children's scissors for our children card games. Um, hopefully we will not destroy anything too valuable or whatever. But uh, yeah. So basically, from what I understand, the uh, Pikachu, uh, Detective Pikachu um, items or packs have four cards uh, with only a total of 18 um, Pokemon or 18 cards in the set without counting the promos, which is kind of disappointing. Uh, I hope the movie won't only have like 18 Pokemon because that would be very sad. God, why, why is this so hard to open, man? Just give me my cards. Ah! There we go. But, the Pokemon TCG did decide to include some other booster packs with pretty much every single one of these items just to help, uh, you know, give the people more than just 18 cards to collect. So we have Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion booster pack here. Uh, and we have two blisters of the Detective Pikachu set, and uh, oh, we have a coin, never forget the coin. This one is not a metal coin, but it is awesome. Look at the bling on that thing. That's the Pikachu's hat with his little ears. It's just a basic plastic coin. We'll put it next to the Pikachu up there. And uh, we have, okay, we have promo merch, official Pokemon merchandise, Cycling Road, Berry Juice, Fresh coffee, police department. Okay, well that's that's just see more at PokemonCenter.com hash slash shop. Okay, that's just this was not a sponsored video, guys. But ooh, this is nice. It looks fancy. When you touch it, it actually feels like 3D. That's good, good stuff. So you guys can take the code. I will not be using it. And we have our promo card. The beautiful, the one and only, Detective Pikachu, voiced by Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds uh, played uh, Deadpool and uh, quite a few other uh, characters in different movies. Honestly, he's played in a lot of movies, but recently, Deadpool, Green Lantern, uh, a few others. Who really cares at this point? It's going to be a funny movie. I'm looking forward to it. I know my girlfriend is also looking forward to it, and I know a few other people are also looking forward to it, so... I mean, if it got that many people's attention, must have a good amount of potential. Anyways, oh, they have uh, this little story there. Skilled in deduction, he's a self-proclaimed great detective. His detective hat is his trademark. Oh, that's just like the coin. Anyways, we'll put that in the back here. So that's that for this, and let's start opening. So we'll start with these, because they're not related to Detective Pikachu. I have no clue what's good to get in Crimson Invasion. Uh, I can't say I've opened a lot of this set before. 
but hey, let's give it a shot. And we have a card. Yeah, no, this one is not 3D like the other one. It doesn't feel the same, at least. Anyways, so uh, three to the front. Energy, energy. Mawile. Counter, Imulga. Staryu, Ghastly, Geodude, Alolan. Magikarp, ooh, that's a nice looking Magikarp with the uh, mechanical one there. Probably Team Rocket. And Wigglytuff, tough, tough. So we'll put the Magikarp there. So let's get to the Detective Pikachu packs in question. So these packs have four cards each, and I believe there are two or three hollows in the whole set overall. Uh, and they're, oh wait, no, they're all foil. Are they? Are they not? Oh, this is getting a little confusing. Anyways, you guys can take the code. I will not be using this. We have Licky Tongue. Oh, they're all foil. Okay. Here, look, let's look at the artworks and stuff. So there are only 18 cards in the set, and this is a common, and that's the Detective Pikachu set logo. So we have Licky Tongue with the uh, awkward looking realistic artwork. Uh, it, it does him well, I guess. The text. It cheeks out whatever is around it by licking everything. If you don't clean off a spot where it slipped you, you'll break out in a rash. That's kind of disgusting. We have Psyduck, which is also a common. Um, using psychokinesis it gives it a headache, so it normally passes the time spacing out and doing as little as possible. That's cute. We have Morlull. Uh, I'm not familiar with this one. He's uh, probably one of the more recent generations. Uh, it scatters its shining spores around itself. Even though they're dangerous, nighttime tours of forests where, where Morlo live are popular. I guess it's because it looks beautiful. Nice. And we have Machamp. Ooh, he's looking cool. Directing traffic. Literally. Nice. So he's probably one of those... Uh... Oh, I just realized this is an evolution and look. These are realistic as hell, and you have the cartoonish uh, basics, or rather their previous evolutions. Huh. Uh, it, grasps, it grasps its opponents with its four arms and twists them up in an intricate hold. People call it the Machamp Special. So that's our rare. We have a rare per pack and three uncommons. That's okay. So we have four cards out of the 18. That's a good start. No doubles in one pack. <laughs> now let's hope the second pack has some new stuff as well. So uh, from what I understand, I think Charizard from the set, not the promo, is the most expensive thing you can pull. Uh, hard to say at this point. We have another little card like this for you guys. We have Jigglypuff, the crazy looking furry thing. Um, recordings of Jigglypuff's strange lullabies can be purchased from department stores. These CDs can be found near the bedding area. Huh. They have bedding areas in their department store. Oh, uh, fair enough. We have Psyduck again. We have Magikarp. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So this is our first double. We'll put aside over there. Magikarp. Uh, in the distant past, they were fairly strong, but they have become gradually weaker over time. Huh. Interesting. Oh, and we have Charizard, Speed of the Devil. I think this is the most expensive card in the set, uh, from what I understand. I think my local stores are selling them for, like, between $15 and $20 Canadian, which is very disappointing for a card that just got out, but it's the rarest card out of the whole set. Look at that. The little star on the bottom there? It's silver. Look at that. It's silver. It shines. That's cool. This guy was black. This guy is shiny. Interesting. Type of rarity. Everything else was common, yeah. Okay. Well then, we've got a Charizard. Nice. So uh, that's probably the most expensive card we'll pull ever in this opening. <laughs> but we still have another little thing to open here. Uh, this one is a little easier to open because it doesn't have the double padding of cardboard. There we go. This second item here, once I'll be able to open it, if I'm able to open it. What the hell is this? There we go. Okay. Anyways, so this one is basically the exact same contents, except for the main reason I bought it was 
this Detective Pikachu binder. So it's a beautiful little binder, which will easily store the 18 new cards from this specific set. And it looks just beautifully cute. Well, you, you guys can see me in the reflection. Hey, guys. Ooh. Anyways, so we have beautiful little uh, drawings, I guess, of Detective Pikachu, obviously. And we can store our brand new cards inside. So the goal by the end of this whole um, mini-series is to fill this with at least one copy of every single card in the set, including the promos. So I really do think they should all fit in here. Otherwise, that would have been a very disappointed little binder. But for now, we're off to a good start. Out of eight, we've pulled seven different cards. And we have some more packs in here. So uh, you guys can have the code card. Here you go. Oh, this one is not as 3D either. That's weird. Where was the other one? 3D. Anyways, so uh, let's keep opening stuff. We have yet another coin. If the coin will come out. There we go. The exact same coin for you guys to see. Yippee. But this time, instead of Crimson Invasion, we have a Burning Shadows. I believe this is the pack... Uh, with the uh, Rainbow Rare Charizard that a lot of people are going crazy about. And, uh, well, they, it's, it's been out for a while, so the the craze has a little bit um, diminished. Oh, we have an, an exact same copy, but the rarity is different, or so it seems. It's it's the same foil, but the uh, the big circles on them are placed differently. And the color of the shading is different. That's kind of interesting to see. I don't know if you guys can see it on the camera because this is not the best lighting ever. Let's try it this way, maybe. I don't know if you guys can see. This one is darker than this one, no matter where you put it. Interesting. Okay. So, um, yeah, one of the Detective Pikachu um, promos will be given away. Not sure which one yet. Probably going to end up uh, buying singles to, uh, you know, spice up a bit and keep the collection intact. But, uh, yeah, let's keep opening some stuff. Let's try to get that Charizard worth lots of buckaroos. One, two, three, to the front. Energy, energy, gone. Guzma, I believe this one is worth a few dollars. Ribombi, curly up, cute. Caterpie. Porygon, Sock, Adish, Chamundaf, Meowth, and nothing. Nothing at all. Okay. Well, I mean, we did get Guzma, so that's more than nothing, I guess. But we have our two packs. Hopefully, we'll pull something good this time again. We pulled Charizard once. Might as well pull it again. That would be a very cool thing to do. If every video we pull a Charizard, that would be great for our uh, value, at least. We have Lickitung. Jigglypuff, Magikarp, and Machamp, all doubles. Oh, and here's your promo code. All doubles? Well, that's kind of sad. Hey, maybe if we get a full collection twice, uh, maybe that could be an extra gift for the giveaway. Who knows at this point? There are still quite a few packs to open in the future. Quite a few. Let's give you guys your code. Boom. Jigglypuff. Psyduck, Magikarp, and Ditto! Hey, a new card! Good! We've got a new card. Oh, and this one's also a um, Silver Starred Rare. Nice. Copy anything. While it can transform into anything, each Ditto apparently has its own strength and weaknesses when it comes to transformations. Huh. Interesting. So we have nine different cards. Or eight different cards. I think it's eight. Anyways, without counting the promo. So we're off to about half of the series collected. I think that's a good start for the first video of about three or four. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. But it's not over yet. It's not over yet. Because the giveaway in question that we mentioned previously will be including this. Uh, this is basically one of those, um, I believe, the uh, sneak peek packs or things. Uh, those little kits that come with a few packs and one of these, like, decks to play. Uh, so yeah, I still have one of these sealed from Celestial Storm. So the winner will be getting 
one of the two versions of Detective Pikachu, and one of these, sealed, and probably quite a few other little Pokemon items or cards at least, because obviously we'll be pulling a lot of these, so might as well include some, exam for example, like a Machamp or a Jigglypuff, because he's one of the main guys in the uh, movie, I believe. So, uh, you know, we'll be including those in the giveaway as well. And we still have our challenge to accomplish today. So we'll be opening a Crossed Souls booster pack. Yes, this is a Pokemon video, but this is still a Yu-Gi-Oh! channel. And we have the little challenge that's been going on for a bit, while, uh, quite a bit now, uh, where we try to get the Ghost Rare version of the first card on top of the pack, which is Clearwing Synchro Dragon. So we'll be trying to get the first edition version of that. I only have some unlimited ones. And that has been a pain to try to get. Void purification and no foils. Wow. Okay, so that concludes this part. And uh, yeah, so um, to enter the giveaway, I will be posting a Gleam link. Not on YouTube because YouTube has made that illegal for some reason. I was, uh, well, I, I lost the link on one of my past uh, contests because of YouTube being mad about us using that kind of link but we'll be putting the link on the facebook page of this youtube channel so do follow the link um you'll find on this uh, youtube channel's main page you know when you go and visit the uh, account so basically follow my um follow the little tag at the bottom there to go to the main page and then there while you're there might as well subscribe <laughs> selfless plug but um yeah, might as well subscribe and enter the giveaway that you will be able to find on the Facebook page of this YouTube account. Sorry for repeating it a lot, but it's the new procedure. It's my first time really doing that here. So um, it's, you know, kind of interesting to try it out. And I will be insisting a bit in the future as well. So you guys can remember. So yeah, until next time, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vid. It's been a pleasure and Panem out. Yeah.